Hello, this is Kelly from Lighthoof Mud Management. I just wanted to show a quick video here of um, some paddocks in bad weather looking bad just to show you, you know, how Lighthoof performs um, when it's not brand spanking new and looking gorgeous. So I'm going to turn the camera around here. Okay, so here is what the outsides of these uh, paddocks look like. Um, on a day when they, you know, they haven't been cleaned. They haven't really, we haven't really done anything to maintain them um, in the two years since they, we put them in. Um, and horses are out on these, you know, all the time. Uh, you can see that a bunch of bedding got tracked out. You know, there are probably ways we could have prevented that. Um, but still it's firm and, you know, that's not forming in, into mud. Uh, we've got some little weeds growing up at the edges, kind of under the fence lines, some places where it might be a little thin and could probably use a little more gravel on top. Uh, but in general, I mean, for zero maintenance, uh, we're really, really pleased. Um, and one of the problems with this barn is that the paddocks were sloping toward the stalls. Um, and so the mud was forming right outside the stalls uh, and also water was just running into the stalls. We didn't have a lot of options to regrade the paddocks to slope away from the barn just because of the shape of this hill and the trees and the buildings that are around there. Um, so what we did was we created this low spot uh, between the hill and the barn basically. So we just cut in and sloped it down to that low spot and then it slopes back up from there. And as you can see, this low spot, which kind of gradually gets uh, further and further away from the barn as it moves toward the back side of these paddocks, is creating a little bit of a river here. So the water flows into that low spot wherever it falls on the paddock. Uh, and then because that sloped gradually, you know, parallel to the barn outside to the back there, that water just runs off um, over the hill into the woods. And there, that way there's no standing water within the paddocks um, because the low spot is sloped so that the water runs outside of the paddocks. And that's a great example of a surface drainage feature um, that can be used to help protect a building. Uh, and one of the ways that in a non-equine application, you might see this as a French drain, um, but in an equine application, using the light hoof to create a supported open drainage feature is gonna be uh, much longer lasting. It's not gonna have problems with clogging or crushing. Uh, and it's gonna be something that keeps your buildings dry and keeps your footing dry year after year with no maintenance. So that's that's how it looks on this extremely rainy, <laughs> icky day. Um, and I hope you guys have better weather where you're at right now. <laughs> Bye.